Hey guys, in this video we're going to discuss how much cash is enough for an emergency type situation. Stick around. Hello YouTubers and Google Plus people. Welcome. I think everybody's uh, finally getting on board with the Google Plus thing and Hopefully we're uh, going to figure this out together, guys. This will be my first video since this huge change went through. Just been kind of laying low and taking it all in. Today's video, I'd like to talk about uh, how much cash does everybody keep around? How much is enough? Um, I've been having this conversation with my wife, and I guess it's kind of a twofold question because... How much cash do you want to have for an SHTF type type situation? Um, and we we have no idea when that will occur, um, and we just prepare for that. So, is that amount of money the same that you would keep around for, let's say, you have a major snowstorm or something that comes through your area? You're going to be without power for seven to ten days, and there's some stores in your community that might be open, um, and they may only take cash because they can't run cards, uh, credit cards, or whatever the situation is. Always having cash on hand is the better way to go. So, how much cash do you keep in your preps? Um, I'm not asking where you keep it. I'm not asking for your hiding spot. And I think that in a long-term situation, of course, it goes down to, well, cash is going to have no value in a long-term SHTF situation where, you know, a roll of toilet paper is going to have a lot more value than the almighty dollar. And that's a whole separate video, is getting into bartering items and things of that nature, because that's just a, a whole separate video. Um, I'm just wondering, from everybody, how much do you guys have in your preps? It's $500, $1,000. I actually have some friends that uh, are pretty well off, and uh, they keep $30,000 uh, in their in their stash. And uh, not everybody has the means to do that, but if you did have the means to do that, would you have $30,000 in your home? Uh, and where you would keep it, and other, that's not this video. I'm just wondering about the number. How much money... Is enough and how much money do you sleep at night knowing that you have in cash um, and how long do you think that that money would hold value in a long-term SHTF situation do you think that after 30 days people wouldn't take cash do you think having silver coins gold coins would have more value or do you think that coffee or alcohol or tampons or ammunition would have more value in a long term because I think that in people's mind they always will think even in a long term situation they're, they're going to think that money will eventually come back and I think that people will always take money now maybe I'm wrong thinking that I don't know I'm just getting your guys opinion but how much money do you guys keep in your preps cash on hand bills good old-fashioned bills uh, that you can have spend how much is enough how much of this stuff do you keep around how much is enough so that's my question today and I'm just curious to get people's responses because I'm coming up with a lot of different numbers in my head and uh, what me and my wife have talked about and keeping on hand um, and I'm just curious to get your thoughts on it. So let me know in the comments section, guys. I think I've got the comment stuff figured, figured out now, and I can actually reply to people. So uh, look forward to your comments. Thanks. Mm -hmm.